this. We can beat this. Well, the walk today is the 10th annual breast cancer awareness walk, and so it's important to raise awareness in our community of breast cancer. My main goal today is to talk about the incidence of breast cancer in our area, um, the trends of, of death from breast cancer in our area, and the things that we can do as women and also men in the community to help raise awareness, to help prevent breast cancer, or to pick it up early so we can uh, hopefully cure breast cancer when we detect it early. Most of you may know that I am a six-year breast cancer survivor. And when I started with the Ricky Smiley Morning Show exactly six years ago, I asked myself, what was my purpose? A lot of people don't know that it was only two months into my dream job that I was diagnosed. And after I received my diagnosis, I said, I can either swim or sink here, but this disease is serious, it's real, but, and, and it's not taboo to talk about anymore. You see, we come out, we, we, we move things, we shake things, and like I said, I had to decide if I was gonna sink or swim, and then I had a pity party, and nobody showed up. And I realized that I had to do everything that I could in my power, not just because it was a pity party for me. I'm like, oh my God, I got my own new job, and I moved to this city. It was when my parents looked at me, and I saw their faces saying, hey, we, we still need our daughter. Whenever they, um when they found my cancer, it was a little, it was behind a benign lump. So that's why it's very important for people to, uh, you know, self-examine and have the mammograms. Uh, we recommend that every woman, woman, excuse me, every woman receives a mammogram at age 40, and yearly after that, no matter if there's an abnormality or not. Uh, if you have a family history of breast cancer, especially someone diagnosed at a young age, we recommend starting screening earlier. And of course, self-breast exams and having clinical breast exams in your doctor's office is important as well. Well, just, you know, when you look around today, you're going to see there's a huge number of people here. A lot of them are cancer survivors, but most of them are just local people in the community who support our survivors here. Uh, you know, it's a big party. You can probably hear the music in the background. Uh, there's food and drinks and everything down here. I just think it's going to be a lot of fun and hope that we can have more and more people every year as we continue to do this. Uh, that's what makes it, that's what makes the difference in your surviving, I think, is your friends and family. And um, staying as healthy as you can, that's, that's important. 